Yo guys, what's up? It's Dave, the Oops Search Gangster here, and today we're going to take a look at an Android app called Showtime. It's an alternative to the stock YouTube app, and I think a million times better. It offers tons of customizations, a variety of features, and it's just really cool. So opening up the Showtime app, we get the standard view that we're used to in a stock YouTube app. We can view our descriptions, trending videos, most popular, etc. Now one thing I do like that you do not get in a stock YouTube app is that you can view the like to dislike ratio. So I think that's really cool before you view a video, say, okay, how many people actually like it versus dislike it? Okay, so probably what you immediately notice right away is that you have more tabs than what you normally have in the stock YouTube app. You have about, comment, similar, and more from the user. Now, what I'm about to tell you might just blow your mind, so make sure you're sitting down for this. You can directly reply to comments in this app. Now that is a feature that has been requested from the stock YouTube app, and people have wanted it, and we just never seen it with the stock YouTube app. And this is one you can finally do it. So I think that's an amazing feature in itself. In addition, in the settings menu, what we could do is we can change the video resolution. So we can actually set it to full 1080p resolution, which that's another thing which is not available in a stock YouTube app. And wait, there's more. You can actually go down and save your video position. So if you're watching a video and you click away to your home screen or do something else and when you go back to viewing that video, you can resume right from where you left off. That is just a great ability, great feature uh, to have. In addition, we can change how it opens up links, aspect ratio, and this does feature a pop-up player, so you can configure how that works. Furthermore, what we can do is go up here to style, and we can customize even how the app looks. We can change the divider, color, uh, drawer text, I mean we can really customize anything about this app, which is just great. So if you're not a fan of the whole red scheme, you can change it to blue scheme, green theme, etc. So these are features that just make this app amazing that we don't find in the stock YouTube app. Now in addition, so when we play this, like I said, this is playing a full 1080p. So I'm going to turn this down. So this is playing a full 1080p. Now what's nice is when we rotate it, it goes into full screen. Now if you're like me, I kind of have a bad habit of rotating my phones accidentally. So what we can do is go up here, hit this lock button right here, and now watch this. When I rotate it back, it stays in the landscape position. It does not change back to portrait. So that's a nice feature if you're trying to watch the video, but if you're like going back and forth, you know, like moving your phone all about, that's a really awesome feature to have. Now let's look at a pop-up player. What we can do is go down here and click this button. We have to probably unlock it first. Click this button. Right down here, we get a pop-up player that will play the video in any app that we're using. So pretty much wherever we're at, I can go right to Chrome right now. Let's open up Chrome. See, I can open up Chrome and I can still have the video playing no matter where I move this around. So this is a really nice feature to have. Like I said, um, it's definitely more integrated than the stock YouTube pop-up player. Because the stock YouTube pop-up player only works within the app. This works within any other app. And of course, at any time, you can just click it and pop it back up to normal size. In addition, within the share options, we can go up here to share. And I know a lot of people always ask, how can you copy the video link? We have the option right down here to copy the clipboard to copy the video link as well. So this app is called Showtime. It's a really great app, like I said. Now there is a paid and free version. I highly suggest that you download it, check it out, have fun with it. There are a lot of features you can do with this, and it's just a great alternative to playing videos via the stock YouTube app. So thanks for watching, and stay tuned for some more galvanizing videos. Thanks.